Hello, everyone. My name is Yi Chun Zhou. In this video, I will talk about our paper, Event Bird, a pre trained model for event correlation reasoning. I will introduce our work according to this outline. First, I introduce the task definition of event. An event, usually a text span composed of a predicate and its arguments fine grained semantic unit to describe the state of entities things, is a, for example, he looks very worried and how they act, for example, I grab his arms. There are examples of two downstream event related reasoning tasks, abductive reasoning at the left and script reasoning at the right, as well as our created corpus at the bottom. Abductive reasoning aims to infer the most plausible explanation for incomplete observations. Given the two observations, Andrew was very drowsy and now he is very alert. We could infer that he took a long nap is more plausible than he stayed up a long time. In script reasoning, given a sequence of events, a frog was hungry, but it was late in the day, and the bugs were not to be found, we need to infer a potential subsequent event, the frog was still hungry. Although formulated as different tasks, they all require event correlation reasoning. Event correlation reasoning has gained much attention and achieved promising success in recent years. However, Many algorithms are designed to solve only some specific tasks. These methods are limited to specific scenarios and cannot generalize well to a broad scope of reasoning. In addition, some pioneering works follow a recently arising paradigm to conduct event-based pre-training for those downstream reasoning tasks. However, these solutions have their own limitations. Comet learns event correlations from a human curated knowledge graph and thus limits its scalability. Deer only model temporal relations and cannot be expanded to other relations, for example, causal, contrast. Cleave use AMR structure of natural language sentences to design self supervised objectives but focus only on event detection task. Firstly, we conduct corpus filtering to ensure training data is rich in event correlation. The filtering unit is set to paragraph since it usually contains a complete storyline or reasoning logic for learning efficacy while consists of mere several sentences to keep filtering efficiency. Besides basic filtering strategies like removing unreadable and meaningless text pieces, we propose to filter paragraphs and keep those with strong event correlation according to discourse relation keywords, for example, however, while. Specifically, we filter out paragraphs without any of the predefined connectives in PDTB, based on our observation that paragraphs with these connectives are prone to contain strong correlation among events and vice versa. Considering that an event is usually centered with a verb, for example, Andrew was very drowsy, he stayed up a long time, we further restrict that these keywords should be adjacent to a verb in the dependency parsing tree to avoid false positive cases where these keywords do not express connectives in some paragraphs. Then, it is essential to extract events in text since explicit event annotations will facilitate designs of unsupervised learning objectives towards event correlation reasoning. Particularly, event extraction aims to find an event trigger, for example, a predicate and then retrieve all arguments, for example, subject, adverb, preposition, for the trigger. Previous works usually employ supervised event extraction models and semantic role labeling but both suffer from high overheads. Thus, for high efficiency, we focus only on verb triggered event and resort to low level syntactic features of a sentence, says dependency parsing tree that describes modification relations between words. Finally, we split the pre training corpus into a training set and a held out test set. We propose three self supervised contrast of learning objectives correlation based event ranking. Contradiction Event Tagging, Discourse Relation Ranking Firstly, 
We introduce event-based negative sampling. Instead of negative sampling by a generative model like GPT, we retrieve diverse events from corpus to avoid pattern gap between human-written and machine-generated text. Thereby, we build an event pool and propose three heuristic schemes to derive candidates of negative events, lexicon-based retrieval, pose-based retrieval, and in-domain retrieval. Based on our training example and corresponding negative samples, we propose the first self-supervised contrast I've learning objective, named correlation-based event ranking, to rank the correlation correct paragraph against the paragraph corrupted by a distracting event. Moreover, we take a step closer to the corrupted paragraphs and determine whether a word belongs to a negative sampled event or the original one. Therefore, we define another self-supervised learning objective based on contrast of examples, called contradiction event tagging, to build a binary classifier at word level. To further exploit event correlation information underlying paragraphs, it is promising to consider another kind of negative sampling from the perspective of discourse relation. That is, we can sample a couple of negative discourse relations to corrupt in the paragraph, and then employ our model to distinguish them. To this end, we propose the third self-supervised contrast of learning objective, discourse relation ranking, with a very similar target with correlation-based event ranking, ranking the original paragraph over the corrupted ones. Thereby, we share learnable parameters in correlation-based event ranking with those in discourse relation ranking here to improve correlation-based ranking and enhance the correlation scoring module. Our model continual pre-trained on book corpus. For continual pre-training, we use Roberta Large as our base model. We evaluate event BERT on four downstream tasks, including script reasoning, abductive common sense reasoning, narrative incoherence detection, and story close test. All these are independent of our pre-trained corpus. There are tables of results on script reasoning and abductive common sense reasoning. It is shown that event BERT significantly outperforms Roberta Large on script reasoning and abductive common sense reasoning. There are tables of results on narrative and coherence detection and story close test. It is shown that event BERT significantly outperforms Roberta Large on narrative and coherence detection and story close test. In conclusion, Event BERT achieves state-of-the-art performance on script reasoning, narrative and coherence detection, and story close test, and it outperforms all baselines of same model size and without additional data. Event BERT's superiority demonstrates that Event BERT is a general event-based correlation reasoning model and can be applied to a wide range of event-related downstream tasks. We apply event BERT and competitors to downstream tasks without fine-tuning. The left figure shows results on script reasoning, abductive common sense reasoning, and story close test. Note that neither Roberta nor event BERT is applicable to narrative and coherence detection task in the zero-shot setting since both of them require an additional task-specific MLP. It is shown Roberta performs similarly to random guess, while event BERT surpasses them by a large margin. Roberta only gets 52.6% accuracy, and event BERT outperforms it by 23% absolute value, verifying event BERT's effectiveness when no task-specific training data is available. The right figure plots the accuracy of Roberta and event BERT on story close test with various sizes of training data. First, when more training data is used, accuracy of both increases since they learn more domain knowledge or task-specific knowledge. Second, event BERT outperforms Roberta by a large margin, about 4% to 6%, and the margin is consistent, which verifies event BERT conducts event-based reasoning better with less task-specific data. We conduct an extensive ablation study on story closed test and left table to investigate the effect of each component of our event BERT. We first remove each of the three objectives during the pre-training.
It is shown that the correlation-based event ranking objective plays a critical role, and the accuracy drops by 2.36% without it. Besides, ablating contradiction event tagging and discourse relation ranking also lead to 0.99% and 1.37% decrease. We also replace the proposed three objectives with existing span-based masked language model for pre-training, which is denoted as Event Span MLM. Compared to our proposed event correlation-based objectives, traditional span-based masked language model cannot fully leverage the event-based corpus, and event bird outperforms it by 3%. To verify event bird is still competitive in NLU after continual pre-training with our objectives, we fine-tune Roberta and event bird on NLU tasks and report average invariance on 5 runs on the dev set in the right figure. The left figure shows examples where event bird can find the correct ending for a story, while the baseline selects a wrong option. The main reason might be that Roberta is more concerned with token level concurrence while event bird takes events as units and focuses on correlation among them. For example, Roberta chooses, I burned it in a fire for the second case, which might be due to strong correlation between dry and burn. In contrast, Event Bird understands that, I found a flower in a field that I have never seen before and, I dried out the flower head, and infers that it is more likely that, I flattened it for my journal. There are some error cases in the right figure, as we can see that it is difficult to select the correct option for some examples. Take the first case as an example, although according to the context we can infer that it is more likely to choose, the cat was really slow, the option itself is somehow contradictory to common sense since usually a cat is fast, leading to confusion during inference. We leave such complex situations for future work. We propose to pre-train a general model for event correlation reasoning from unlabeled text. To achieve that, we create a corpus by filtering out paragraphs without strong event correlation and further extracting events for remaining ones. Then we present three correlation-based self-supervised objectives for pre-training. The derived model, Event Bird, outperforms strong baselines on four downstream tasks in both zero-shot and supervised fine-tuning settings. Thank you.